हेलो एवरीवन वी होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल वेलकम टू अनदर फैन टू प्ले फैंटेसी मैच रिव्यू दिस इज फॉर द गेम बिटवीन द हरिकेन्स एंड द स्टार्स एंड इट्स गोइंग टू बी प्लेड एट द बेलरी ओवर होबाट वी हैव निखिल भाई विद अस टुडे लॉट ऑफ इंस एंड आउट्स इन द टीम सो लॉट ऑफ स्ट्रेटजिक हेल्प रिक्वायर्ड फ्रॉम हिम सो व्हाट आर योर इनसाइट्स निखिल भाई हाउ डू यू सी इट पैनिंग आउट विद स्टॉइनस वेड बोल्ड मेनी बिग नेम्स गोइंग आउट सो इट विल बी मोर रैंडम टू पुट इट वेरी वेरी व्हेन इट ऑलरेडी वाज yeah uh, again the problem is in that it's not that you can't visualize that way but uh, the issue is ke aapko bahut specific sochna padta hai aur mujhe waise games kam pasand lagte hain jab aapko ek ya do player hi lagte hain to come off in the green zone so again different people work differently uh, ab kyunki bade log nahi hain to aap fir se dekhenge jo jo local players hain jo domestic लेजेंड या जायंट्स अगर आप कहेंगे ऑस्ट्रेलिया में देल हैव अ बिगर रोल टू प्ले बट दे आर नॉट नोन फॉर देयर कंसिस्टेंसी तो अगर आप एक बाव वेबसर को कैप्टन बना रहे हो तो वो ट्रिक है इन इट सेल्फ इज अ वेरी ट्रिकी थिंग टू डू तो इसके लिए ऑफकोर्स ऑलवेज गो विद योर विजुलाइजेशन माइट एंड अप मेकिंग बोलर्स कैप्टन बट अगेन द कैचिंग एंड इवन द अम्पायरिंग आई थिंक मुझे के एलिटी के बाद मेरा तो हो don't know zero down negative ho gaya abhi from the league so i think that's also good way good sign for me ke now i'm only playing grandix and then i'm trying everything so jab wo chal jayega ek combination perfect baith jayega jai mata di right that's the order of the day with all the ins and outs and all the random events that have already occurred sometimes there's no ball tracking and many a times yeah. there are but fingers So let's see first up what we can expect from the venue. So Nikhil bhai as far as the venue is concerned we have seen that it's one of these balanced venues where you cannot really pick out a specific bowling type to work for you or any specific phase where wickets have fallen more so but we have seen a balanced T20 wicket 160 170 kind of scores except for that one odd game against the Renegades so do you just see it playing out in that way and the conditions might not be a big factor in team changes yes i think so and also hurricanes i think play very well at the venue last patch me sirf ek hi game hare wo log uh that came against the heat and that's when zevia bartlett had his annual new ball spell jahan pe unhone char wicket le liye the shuru mein but runs fir bhi bane the 150 bana tha wahan pe uh, batting first to humne dekha runs ban rahe hain चेज भी हो रहा है और द गुड थिंग विथ हेरिकेन्स और बैड थिंग आप कहो तो ना विथ नो वेट रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी इज ऑन द रेस्ट तो एक्सपेक्टेशन कम होंगी क्योंकि वो वैसे कम होता है तो वेरी इंटरेस्टेड टू सी हाउ पीपल आर कमिंग इन टू द स्कॉट डू डासी शॉर्ट हैज एन हैड अ गुड टाइम ज्वेल साहब के चल पड़ी है तो नॉर द ओनर्स इज ऑन देम टू कीप डूइंग इट क्योंकि दे कैन बी पार्ट ऑफ द लॉन्गर रन तो आई एक्सपेक्ट help for both batters and bowlers predominantly pace bowlers i think shadab is the only spinner who took a lot of wickets here uh teen jo unhone liye the ek baar uske baad i think most of the wickets have gone to pace only so pace friendly if hari gets bat first put up a good score should be good yes absolutely so expect balanced conditions and let's see how we have set up our base team based on the same yeah so base team first up like we already said matthew wade is not available for the game so joe clark is the only option that you have left here kustin paines not in the squad either in the batting we've gone with ben mcdermott and tim david tim david has been part of the fifth bowling quota for them but keep in mind that if darcy short comes in he might be ahead in terms of bowling preference rather than david yeah so that would be a point for you to consider and uh, apart from that you have a lot of options here uh caleb joel being the safest one actually and you have other choices like cartwright rogers everyone has played one odd knock here and there yeah. but uh, it's been how it has been so we have said across games i even said it in the renegades game finch has a great ground record but do i trust finch to come off with when i'm not trusting anyone around to come off because that does not only mean i have to rely on finch ability i have to also rely on the situation to work for him yeah. didn't work for him he failed he failed at the place and guptil came off so yeah that's how that's how it's been going and uh, 
like we say the bowlers are the guys who are giving you the bank of at least 25 27 odd points especially when you are able to pick out the guys who are bowling full quota so don't ponder too much over the batting because till now the approach has worked for us 7 out of 10 times so two or three times there will be one batter who will come and deliver the goods like Joel has and in the all rounders we have gone with webster and fai mashraf so nikhil bhai any thoughts anyone else that you would like to pick apart from these guys in these sections no i think ye do kafi hain uh, with the bat bhi agar aap dekhen to the likes of crawley larkin carter they have all shown glimpses ke bhai we can do a lot carter especially is someone that i enjoy watching him play and ab unki batting number 3 pe pehle niche thi aur to you could still hope ke bhai agar naye ball se wicket ja rahe hain so he is the guy who you can rely on to come down and score so hmm. i still feel carter is a handy differential to try but again it's not a differential bbl mein pura league differential hai so hmm. you just have to back your visualization agar aapko lagta hai ki ha one of carter or crawley can come off then you can definitely back them we as always will stick to our strengths that is picking all rounders and bowlers kyunki they just keep you in the game a bit more so i think with no stoinis also webster's role becomes very very critical so ideal candidate i think for captain common captain i'm sure yahi rahenge sab yes absolutely and in the bowling we have gone with parry dooley didn't play the last game but he is continued to stay in the squad so we expect him to play this one nathan coultonile riley meredith nathan ellis all have delivered at some points adam zampa who's yet to deliver which is very surprising to say for us and luke wood who has been good in patches now apart from this liam hatcher is someone for whom you can expect to play browdy couch has also been brought into the squad but hatcher has played a few games here and there so expect him to start in this game and this is what our team looks like based on those changes yes bilkul aap dekhen bowling options rahe hain kafi for both sides but they have been very patchy isme se bhi you will say nc and meredith they've gone games where they haven't taken enough wickets while hurricanes probably have a signed contract ke bhai ek do catch drop to mandatory i think they have the most catch drops in the entire season yeah, this season i posted that yesterday 60 they have only taken 65% of their catches and they have dropped 14 in eight games so <laughs> so i mean that is it just tells you the kaisa hota hai jab aap us pe risk lo aur wo aapke khilaf chalta hai so i think that's where also you need to be very self assured ke it was it was on your mistake आपने विजुअलाइजेशन सही करा बट अगर आपके हाथ में आज नहीं जा रहा है तो होपफुली कल या परसों जाएगा सो दैट इज ऑल्सो वन वे टू लुक बैक एट गेम्स एट ओके नाउ वीव मेड एलिस वाइस कैप्टन नाउ हिज ऑलवेज क्रिएटेड चांसेस सभी गेम में बट बहुत गेम में एक दो चांसेस मिस हो गए एंड देन ही एंड्स अप विकेटलेस तो वो आपके लिए यूजर्स आल्सो हैज बीन पैथेटिक टू बी ऑनेस्ट दे यूज्ड देम इन द लास्ट गेम फॉर द लास्ट टू ओवर्स व्हेन ओनली 17 रन्स वर लेफ्ट ऑफ 18 बॉल्स सो especially when you are you have someone who can create chances why would you leave them for the point when your your game is already done and dusted yeah i think ek cheez the captain mujhe, in this game so <laughs> hopefully he uses think, himself better i think ek cheez jo mujhe bahut uh, aisa laga ke in the entire bbl even the game that happened the last night the sixers game uh, sands and nathan mckinnon had six is overs left after the 10 over mark i think they are focusing too much on the power surge and what after that as opposed to trying to break the game open so wo i think that is where captains are getting a bit muddled ke okay if i use him now who do i use in power surge tab kya hoga but game tab tak aadhi nikal jati hai for most of the teams so uh, yes please aapke hisab se jo combination aapke liye better hai ek aur baat hai zyada log yahi combination leke aaye hmm so i don't see the only thing that might change is the batter or your captain my captain so i don't think that the base hai wo zyada change hone wala hai to मेरे हिसाब से स्पेशल रिस्क लेवल इट इज प्रो मैक्स बिकॉज द पर्सन यू टेक रिस्क ऑन इफ दैट गाय क्लिक्स देर इज नो आंसर टू लाइफ इन दिस वेरी लीग तो गेम टाइप आई थिंक इट शुड स्टिल रिमेन वॉट इट इज दैट इज मीन इज Yes, absolutely. Because practically, the only options you are left with to try are very high risk batters. Whether you say Larkin, Cartwright, Rogers. you have not seen any but i don't remember any of them scoring 30 plus in more than two games on a string so that should tell you the amount of risk that you will have to take to make it work for you with the 12th or 13th player but that is what sums up the base team for us and now let's look at grand league options
so two grand league options first up from me for this game paddy dooley if he plays i had made him vice captain till he got ruled out in the last two minutes but if he plays and uh, if he's bowling second i'll try to make him captain or vice captain again if uh, there are not enough signs that webster is going to bowl his full quota and uh, my second pick is nick larkin I think he was he looked decent in the chances that he got stayed not out in one odd game but again they pushed him down the order but against this bowling lineup it's not going to be easy for any of their top order to stick through so I think even if he's coming low he can have good value and uh, if Paddy Dooley doesn't play then my GL pick from Hurricanes is Asif Ali. Oh we have that uh, mandatory pick there. Take a take a call uh game me right my two picks one of them is part of the base team and who i feel is long due for a very good performance and i think that's adam zampa uh slightly surprised with the way he has been used some games only at the end some games more in the middle and some up top well aisa so hopefully he can find enough wickets because eventually aapko wickets say use kabhi karo bhai humko wickets se matlab so first is adam zampa and other is there is that one annual dasi shot performance left where he'll score a 60 by 70 and also roll his arm over and take three wickets so hopefully by the grace of god and almighty whichever whatever faith you want to pray to hopefully these are the yeah, two guys who click yes and it can really work out for zampa too because he is coming up against a line of right handers so if for uh, dasi go if uh... Yeah, now Darcy and Joel. If I, they, these guys go early, especially Joel, because he looks like the more threatening component, he can really have a day out. Yeah. So yes, that wraps up our preview for this game. We hope all of you enjoyed it. Have a good game and tell us in the comments who is your dream team captain for this one. Have a good one. Have a good game, guys.